All right, so this is uh, two, two, three, almost three weeks, right? Yep. Uh, three three follow weeks. Up. Yeah, and Ryan's kind enough to, for me to uh, sh do the document and uh, to show the audience uh, what's it look like doing the healing phase and all stuff. And um, he 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 even told me about the vaccination for the COVID, and he said the COVID is more painful for him. <laughs> yeah, arms a little sore yeah. like yesterday. <laughs> that uh, that that the hair transplant recovery. <laughs> so easy. <laughs> yeah. So, but um, if you can look down so the audience can see, he yeah. said, yeah, you see, uh, go slightly look up for me. Yeah, there you go, and uh, they can look up there. You go, and just to show the audience what it like. There's still some pinkness and eventually it will disappear. He has still some scab, but he could have been a little bit more aggressive, get rid of the scab. It's safe to do. Okay. Um, um, around, on the eighth day, you Very can, gentle. <laughs> yeah, oh, which is fine, you know, and it's, uh, because uh, the more gentle you are, the first, you know, uh, couple weeks is, is good. But after a month, you, you can be very safe and take oh, it off and all awesome. stuff, okay? And um, yeah, so, so, you know, eventually we're going to do month to month and and uh, Ryan can allow us to show the transformation slowly and see how young and handsome he looks. But I anticipate around six months you're going to see he, his look going to change and then a year for full growth. And uh, so you see the, the pinkness, but you see the shape of the hairline. Uh, we have a, a little curve on both sides. And then uh, the temple, we brought it in the temple a little bit on this side. <clears throat> and brought it in too because we want to make sure we we'll proportional vertically and horizontally as well and so the the tempo will be flow on both sides and then has a good zigzag I gave him a medium tight zigzag mm -hmm. um, to give him a little bit more density because he's here it's a little bit uh, thin on the finer side so we want to push up the density as well um, we did the A cell and the amniofil right yes we did but, yeah so that to help boost the uh, uh, he's here. He's healing uh, faster and uh, uh, reduce complication and as well. And um, so I'm uh, excited for that. And uh, for him, we decided to do the uh, month monthly steroid injection to the scar, and that help prevent the scar from stretching. So I want to make sure I take good care of him and try to give him the best result. And he'd be very consistent to be able to come into my clinic once a month from now on to uh, to give us a. Uh, update and uh, injection okay all right sounds good i'll see you next month thank Bye. you